Uh, what originally brought me to Gould was the skiing plus academics. Uh, a lot of the other schools I was looking at were straight, ac uh, straight academics or straight skiing. And um, Gould really they melded the mix. And you get a little bit of everyone at Gould. Um, it's not just, it's a real uh, heterogeneous mixture. Everyone's not the same. Probably the four point program. Uh, when I was a freshman, I went to Hungary. Um, that was just a good experience. That was my first time in Europe. And uh, probably the second experience was my junior year, also the four point program, um, spending uh, 10 days in the woods uh, during the, in the winter time, winter camping. I uh, definitely a challenge in every single way. I take, this is, I've taken five APs total. Um, definitely uh, stretched me pretty thin. Um, all the help I need from the teachers and all the resources are at Gould. Average training schedule is basically I have Mondays off. Uh, that's the day to do all the work um, that I missed over the weekend <laughs> from being away. Um, Tuesdays we have morning practice. It's really nice to get out early. Uh, that's an interval day. Um, we get out here about 8.30 and we just start hammering. We have our coach yelling at us, screaming at us pretty good, um, gets us going. Wednesdays, um, long distance day. Um, that's where we basically just try to pack on the endurance um, and it's pretty slow. We don't do anything real rigorous. Uh, Thursday is another speed day, more intervals. Um, usually because it's two days before a race, we don't go very long, maybe about 45 minutes. Um, Friday is my pre-race day um, workout and I do 45, 30, 15s. So I do 45 minutes of L1, that's really easy, and then I do 30 minutes of L2, and then I do 15 minutes of L3, and then I'll maybe do two minutes of L4. Um, that's race pace. Um, and then Saturday, Saturdays and Sundays, I'm usually racing. Uh, his basic philosophy is uh, building skiers for the future. He's not really looking for results right now. Um, he really wants to see us do well um, maybe 10, you know, five, 10 years down the road versus um, next week. So uh, we're doing a lot of just a lot of prep. He's, he's taken a lot of skiers who have not even seen snow before. Most of our team um, really didn't ski um, other than like five of us until this year. And he's really done a remar remarkable job of um, bringing them together and teaching them the basics and basically indulging them in the skiing world, um, whereas most people usually don't see it from the outside. Alarm clock goes off about uh, 6.45, make a mad dash for the shower. Um, then I head on over to breakfast. Um, we basically have big selection of anything I want to eat. Um, then I uh, go back to my room for a little bit, uh, and then at 7.45 I have assembly, um, where I sit with my advisory group in the uh, auditorium. After assembly, I head on over to the ski room, where I get prepped and ready to go out and train. Um, I get on snow about 8.30, um, and we usually meet up about 8.45 to hear the schedule for the day out on the snow. Uh, we break up into our groups, which is um, the high school racing team and the Eastern Cup comp team. Um, there's about five of us in the comp team. Um, and we do our separate workouts um, with different coaches. My coach is uh, Ben Kemilevich. Um, Jeremy's the head coach, but Kemilevich is the comp coach. Um, then I basically, if it's a Thursday, I would do only about 45 minutes to an hour um, of uh, probably technique work. Uh, after the technique work, I head back in, um, I shower up and I do some homework for lunch that starts at 11. Um, hit lunch at 11, um, stay, stay in there a long time because I like to eat. <laughs> then I, uh, I go to the library for a little bit and I um, do some work before class. Uh, class starts at 12.50 and then I have class from 12.50 to 5 o'clock, um, four classes. And then after that, it's dinner at 5.30. Um, and then uh, 7 o'clock there's study hall and 9.30 is in dorms.